time. It's the one constant in our lives, always marching forward. We experience it as a linear progression from the past, through the present to the future. But what if this perception of time is incomplete? What if, in the realm of the very small, time isn't a one-way street but rather a two-way lane? This is the mind-bending possibility suggested by quantum retrocausality. The idea that the future can influence the past. It challenges our fundamental understanding of cause and effect. Suggesting that events in the future could ripple backward in time to affect what has already happened. While this might sound like science fiction, experiments in quantum mechanics, the theory governing the subatomic world, suggest it might be more science than fiction. To understand retrocausality, we first need to delve into the bizarre world of quantum mechanics. This is a realm where the rules of classical physics no longer apply, and things get truly strange. In this realm, particles like electrons and photons don't behave like the everyday objects we're used to. Instead, they follow their own set of rules that defy our conventional understanding of reality. They exist in a state of superposition, meaning they can be in multiple states at once, like a coin spinning in the air, both heads and tails simultaneously, until we measure it. This concept challenges our very perception of existence. Furthermore, the act of observing these particles determines their state. It's as if the universe waits for us to look before deciding what to be. This is known as wave function collapse. The wave function, which describes all possible states, collapses into a single state upon observation. Imagine that spinning coin. The moment we catch it and see either heads or tails, we've collapsed its state of possibilities into a single outcome. This analogy helps us grasp the abstract nature of quantum mechanics. This inherent uncertainty and the observer-dependent nature of reality are central to quantum mechanics and open the door to the possibility of retrocausality. Retrocausality suggests that future events can influence the past, a concept that turns our understanding of time on its head. Retrocausality, put simply, is the idea that an event in the future can influence an event in the past. Imagine throwing a ball and then realizing you could have thrown it differently to achieve a better outcome. In a world governed by retrocausality, that realization could travel back in time, influencing your initial throw. This concept challenges our intuitive understanding of causality, where the cause always precedes the effect. However, in the quantum realm where particles exist in a blurry state of possibility, the strict chronological order of cause and effect may not always hold. One of the most compelling pieces of evidence for retrocausality comes from the delayed choice experiment, a fascinating variation of the famous double slit experiment that has puzzled scientists for decades. In the standard double slit experiment, particles such as electrons or photons are fired at a barrier with two slits. This setup is simple yet profound in its implications. Instead of going through one slit or the other, the particles act like waves, going through both slits simultaneously and creating an interference pattern on a screen behind the barrier. This wave-like behavior is a cornerstone of quantum mechanics. In the delayed choice experiment, the decision of whether to measure which slit the particle goes through is made after the particle has already passed through the slits. This twist adds a layer of complexity and intrigue to the original experiment. Astonishingly, even though the choice is made after the particle has seemingly decided its path, the experiment still shows an interference pattern if the which path information is not measured and a particle-like pattern if it is. This suggests that the act of measurement itself influences the outcome retroactively. It's as if the particle knew in advance how it would be measured in the future. 
This phenomenon challenges our conventional understanding of time and causality, opening up new avenues for exploring the mysteries of the quantum world. Section 5. Understanding Retrocausality, a Helpful Analogy Thinking about these concepts can be, well, mind-boggling. The idea that the future can influence the past is not something we encounter in our everyday lives. To make it easier, imagine a river flowing downstream. This river represents the normal, linear flow of time that we are all familiar with. This represents the normal flow of time where events move from the past to the present and into the future in a straightforward manner. Now, picture a series of buoys placed in the river. Each buoy can be thought of as a specific moment in time. These buoys represent moments in time, floating along with the current, moving from the past to the future. Normally, a buoy further downstream, which stands for the future, wouldn't affect a buoy upstream, which stands for the past. The flow is one directional. However, in the quantum world, imagine the river being incredibly sensitive to even the slightest disturbance. This sensitivity changes the dynamics entirely. If a buoy downstream were to be disturbed, it could create ripples that travel upstream, affecting the position of buoys further up the river. This is a significant departure from our usual understanding of cause and effect. This is analogous to how events in the future might ripple back to influence the past in the quantum realm. It's a fascinating concept that challenges our traditional notions of time and causality. Section 6. The Quantum Eraser. Experiment. Erasing the Past from the Future. Taking the strangeness a step further, the quantum eraser experiment suggests that we might even be able to erase the past from the future. In this experiment, the which path information in the delayed choice experiment is erased after the particle has already passed through the slits. Astonishingly, erasing this information in the future retroactively restores the interference pattern as if the particle never went through a specific slit in the first place. This experiment suggests that actions taken in the future can alter the very fabric of past events, blurring the line between cause and effect even further. Section 7. Implications of Retro-Causality, Rethinking Time and Reality the implications of retrocausality are far-reaching. It challenges our fundamental understanding of time as a linear progression and suggests a universe where the past, present, and future are interconnected in ways we are only just beginning to comprehend. Could our choices today be influenced by our future selves? Could our understanding of free will need to be re-evaluated? These are just some of the profound questions raised by the possibility of retrocausality. Section 8. Beyond retrocausality, the interconnectedness of time. While retrocausality might seem like a radical concept, it hints at a deeper truth about the universe, the interconnectedness of time. If the future can indeed influence the past, it suggests a reality where time is not merely a linear progression, but a complex tapestry of interconnected events. This has profound philosophical and scientific implications. It suggests a universe where the past is not fixed, the future is not predetermined, and the present is a constantly evolving nexus of past, present, and future influences. Section 9. The Future of Retrocausality. Unraveling Time's Mysteries. The study of retrocausality is still in its infancy, and many questions remain unanswered. However, the experiments conducted so far provide compelling evidence that the future may indeed be able to influence the past, at least at the quantum level. As we delve deeper into the mysteries of the quantum world, we may uncover even more bizarre and counterintuitive phenomena that challenge our understanding of reality. The journey into the heart of quantum mechanics is just beginning, and with it, 
the potential to unravel the greatest mystery of all, the nature of time itself.